At RoofingFoil.com, one of the most common questions we get is whether to use the single-sided product that only has foil on one side or to use the double-sided product that has foil on both sides when installing a metal or a tile roof. First, let's take a look at the most common installation method. The roofing foil is rolled out directly on top of the underlayment and then the battens are installed over the foil. For this type of application, only the single-sided roofing foil product is needed. The single-sided product has shiny aluminum foil on one side and kind of a milky uh, frosted pattern, woven pattern on the back side. It's installed with the foil facing up. It must face the airspace. Since there's no airspace between the roofing foil and the underlayment, using the double-sided product with aluminum on the back side will provide no additional benefit. You can use the double-sided product if you want. It won't provide any additional benefit except that it cannot be installed wrong and it costs about $10 per roll per thousand square feet more. The single-sided product could be installed wrong. If the foil side is put in facing down with the milky or the frosted side facing up and you eliminate that airspace, you could install it wrong and eliminate the benefit of the radiant barrier. So it really depends on how confident you are that it's going to be installed correctly. We have contractors who buy full crates of the single-sided product who never have an issue. And we have contractors who say, hey, I'm willing to spend $20, $30, $40 a job to make sure that it's impossible to install wrong. I will point out that there are a couple of install methods where you definitely want to use the double-sided roofing foil product. This is the product that has aluminum foil on both sides. And I cover these in detail in the how to install video. But briefly, the two methods are if you're installing a corrugated product over a batten system and you're putting the radiant barrier in between, or if you're putting the foil between a batten counter batten system shown here. When you've got an airspace on both sides of the foil, it's going to work off both qualities of reflectivity on the top, it's going to reflect the heat, and it's going to work off the emissivity quality on the bottom layer facing this airspace. So in conclusion, if you're installing a metal or tile roof, all you really need is the single-sided product with the foil facing up. Make sure that foil faces the airspace. You can use a double-sided product. It costs a little bit more, but it makes it impossible to install wrong. For more information, visit roofingfoil.com. If you enjoyed this video, please like this video. If you'd like to see some related roofingfoil.com videos, click on the links to the side. Finally, if you'd like to subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the button below. Thanks for watching.